for me, the passion just comes from the joy that you see when people eat. Maybe because I am Chinese, I always think food should be shared. So for me, food in general is about sitting down and taking the time. I was born in China, Shanghai, and we migrated here as a family when I was 10. Being just a typical family in China, my parents, they were just very comfortable. And then coming here in a new environment, suddenly it changed the dynamic I think the language barrier affected their confidence a lot. It almost feels like me living a life that is a lot more assimilated than my mum. I was a dentist. I was building my career and I'll tell her about it, but she's looking in from the outside a bit. Opening up a restaurant has been something that sat in the mind of my mom and I for a long time before we did it. She used to own a little noodle box shop and then she sold it and never really getting any good ideas of what she might do next. I was looking around for something and I was feeling a bit stuck. But then one day I called my mom and I said, hey, I saw this place that looked available. It's in a really good spot. After that, everything just started happening. Chinese food, especially dumplings. It was more like fast food in Melbourne. There is so much history and there is so much art in Chinese food. I wanted to create an environment that really sets the scene and invites people to take the time and sit down and enjoy it. Our dumpling artists, they are just amazing. When people walk past our window, so many people love watching. When they're doing it, they're doing it so effortlessly. I think we're all kind of a bit captivated whenever we see someone that is an expert. The way we run Chi Bao is we try to do what we do best. I manage the front of house, then I manage how we present the food, and my mom manages the kitchen. Working so closely with my mom, I think the project itself gave us a lot of meaning. We've had so many fights and <laughs> healthy ones, I like to think, healthy conflict. For me, seeing her working and being a leader again and being so great at being a leader, it's just very nice. It's just very fulfilling. Being part of Yarraville, there is this infectious nature. Everyone was there to look after each other. Well, I always felt Yarraville had a lot of diversity. Chi Bao was an opportunity almost for me to show off my culture. It just feels like you're giving people something a little bit more than food. You're giving people a sense of pride in their community.